You're not making money until you're making money when you're not working. Mm. I didn't make no money when I didn't do a show. You see what I'm saying? I had to work to get the money every time. When I'm not in the show and the show is still, they going, how you keep yourself off your own show? Oh, they don't understand that. Right. I'm like, cause this motherfucker on automatic pilot. Today, we're gonna be talking about a topic that everybody loves, passive income. Now, when it comes to passive income, there's really only two ways to get it. You either gotta invest your money or your time. Ain't no way around it. So let's get into the first way. Number one, have someone run your Instagram page. This one right here is gonna require some money. And I actually do this myself right now. I have my girl running my Instagram page called Save Money by Black. And then I have someone else running their Instagram page for my app. For Save Money, I had to build that one up myself from scratch. Just posting every single day and buying promos to grow it as fast as possible. And look, I got that page to a couple bands a month in promos, but I didn't have the time to run it because I was focused on other things. So I had to make a decision, either continue to run it, but not give it my all or pay someone else to run it. Now I know y'all probably like drill, that's an easy decision, but look, it's really not because I'm the type of person that wants to do everything myself. I don't need no help, man. I can do everything myself. That's just how I came up. No money, no mentors, no guidance, nothing. Like I said, Save Money was my baby. You know, I watched that page grow from scratch. So I just couldn't let it go just like that. You feel me? But eventually I let it go. I just had to in order to grow. This is one of the best decisions I made because now I don't have to worry about anything on that page at all. But the page is still growing and I'm still making money from it every single month. So that's how I got Save Money to start making passive income. Now my other page is for my app that's coming out. I'm trying to build a whole separate audience for that app. So I really don't have time to run that page and grow it myself. So I hired one of my subscribers to run it for me. That page is going to drive more people to download my app, which is going to make me more money. So y'all could do the same thing. Either grow a page yourself or hire someone else to grow a page for you so you can start making some passive income. Number two, a YouTube channel. Now look, I told y'all time and time again that YouTube is one of the best ways to start making passive income. And once again, there's two different ways to make passive income. By either investing your money or your time. When it comes to YouTube, I took the investing my time route. Matter of fact, let me show you something. So look, I'm on my YouTube channel right now. Now this is my second channel called Drell Jones, right? And this is the very first channel that I built up. And you can see like you can make passive income on YouTube because last month in September, I didn't post a single video on this channel, but I still made $375. And matter of fact, I didn't post a single video on this channel since January, right? But I'm still making money every single month from this channel regardless, no matter if I post or not. So that's one of the ways that you can make passive income, just building up a YouTube channel. And then if you want to continue posting, you can. But if not, you can still make money every single month as long as people keep watching your videos. But look, I get it. You don't want to be on camera. So this is where you can pay someone else to make content for you so you don't have to do it yourself. I got two channels pulled up and I just wanted to show you guys that you don't have to be on camera to make money on YouTube, right? So this channel right here, they have over a million subscribers. It's called Far From Average. And as you can see, they're getting views every single video that they post this one they posted two hours ago already got 6,000 views one week ago 73,000 views two weeks ago 152k so as you can see they're making money and they're not even showing their face in their videos let me actually click on one real quick as you can see no face to be found and then on this other channel right here the most amazing top 10 they have over 7 million subscribers and as you can see they're getting views on every single video that they upload so that means they're making money they wouldn't be posting a couple times a day if they weren't making any money. And these videos right here, they're not showing their face at all either. So you see, there's real money to be made doing this, but how? So I'm on a website called Fiverr.com and this is where you're gonna get everything you need to make videos on YouTube without showing your face, right? So the first thing you're gonna need is some content, right? So if you wanna do a top 10 channel, so, so all you have to do is type in top 10 videos. There's people that'll actually make this type of content for you. All you have to do is pay them. So let me go on this person real quick. I will make top 10 YouTube video or cash cow videos with script and voiceover. So he's doing the script and voiceover for you. I was just about to mention those, but he's doing all three in one. So he's gonna make the video for you, do the voiceover and the script. So that takes out all of the work when it comes to making a YouTube video. As you can see right here, he has different packages. He got the basic, the standard, and then the premium. This is gonna cost you $125. But let's say you just wanna get someone to make the content for you, right? So all you have to do is type in voiceover. You can come over here 
and find someone else to do a professional voiceover for you. Whether you want to be on camera or not, YouTube is one of the best ways to make passive income. Third way to make passive income is to get an ebook made. Now this one is going to cost you a couple hundred, right? You're going to go on websites like Fiverr and Upwork.com and find someone to make an ebook for you. This is going to cost you between $100 and $300. But the best thing about this is once you get the ebook made, you're going to be able to make money off it forever. Because it's a digital product, there's no limit to how much you can sell. And you really want to take your time when you're looking to get someone to make your ebook for you because you don't want to run into any copyright issues or anything like that. You want to make sure that the person that's writing your ebook does quality work. But after you get it made, you got to start driving traffic to get sales. You can either use free traffic or paid traffic. Let me give you a real example of each one of these. So I'm on an Instagram page called Black Millionaires, right? And he has over 600,000 followers on his page, right? Now what he does is he promotes his ebook for free using his Instagram page. So this is the power of having your own audience, building up your own Instagram page or YouTube channel. You can use that audience to make money for free, no matter what you're selling. So let me actually scroll down. Let me give you guys a real example of him actually promoting this book. So let's see right here. As you can see, he's promoting an ebook on how to grow your Instagram page so he's just promoting it on his page and he's making money for free using his audience so this could apply to you as well right so let's say you have a page in the spiritual niche or the health and fitness niche right you could go on upwork or fiverr and find someone that creates you a health and fitness ebook or like a workout guide and then you can sell it on your page for free now the second way i want to show you is promoting on other people's pages right so let's say you don't want to take the time to build up your own instagram page or your own youtube channel you can go on other people's pages and promote your ebook that way right so someone did this on my page a day ago actually right so if you scroll over you can see that she's promoting her ebook on my page so you don't even have to have your own audience you don't have to have your own instagram page or nothing but you are going to be investing your money fourth way to make passive income is buying ads for affiliate marketing now this one takes me back to my roots. Back in the day, I used to be heavy into affiliate marketing, right? And I was getting tired of relying on just my Instagram page to get sales. Cause I was grinding every single day just to make a little bit of money. So I got to thinking of some ways that I can make affiliate marketing more passive. And then I discovered this method. So look, I'm on my ClickBank account right now. And I just want to show you guys proof that this method works. I'm still making passive income to this day from this method. And I did this method like one to two years ago. So it's been over a year since I did this method and it's still bringing me passive income every single week. As you can see right here, I haven't touched this ClickBank account all year. But let me go back to the method. So it's gonna be on YouTube, right? And this applies to any niche, right? So what you wanna do is you wanna type in things related to the product that you're selling, right? If you go on ClickBank and you find a good product in the health and fitness niche, let me go to health and fitness. And as you can see, let's just take this product for example. You wanna sell this product, you're in the health and fitness niche, right? You wanna go on YouTube and you can type in weight loss journey. And then from here, you wanna search it by this month. And this is just gonna show you the people that are uploading recently, right? And then from here, you wanna take a look at their channels. We wanna find channels that are getting a decent amount of views on every single video that they upload. Now this one right here, they're not doing too well, so let me go back. This one seems like they getting a, a okay amount of views. Once you find a channel that's getting a decent amount of likes and comments on their videos, you wanna reach out to them and ask them to promote your affiliate product in one of their future YouTube videos. And all you gotta do is go to about and then they have their business email, right? You just wanna email them and ask them how much do they charge for a 60 second advertisement in the beginning of their next video. Y'all gonna work out a price, you're gonna pay them, and then they're gonna promote your product in their video, which is gonna start making you passive income because the videos on YouTube stay up forever. And you can see in my ClickBank account, I'm still making money from someone shouting out the ClickBank product in their video from years ago. So I highly recommend you guys to try it out. And like I said, it doesn't matter what niche you're in as long as you got a good product. Fifth way to make passive income is an app. Now this one right here, I'm excited for this one because this is the newest way that I'm gonna be making passive income. Don't get me wrong though, you're gonna have to have some money for this one. But if you do and you invest in the right app, is worth it. Let me break it down. Here are some app revenue stats for 2021. Users are spending 380 billion worldwide in in-app purchases. App revenue statistics show that in 2020, the total ad revenue was 581.9 billion. The prediction for overall mobile app market is for continuous growth reaching the staggering 
935 billion in revenue in 2023. Consumer spending on the app store will reach nearly 200 billion by 2025. Now just imagine if you were the owners of Toro, Instacart, DoorDash, you will be making so much money in passive income. So that's what I decided to do. I invested over $60,000 of my own money to get an app made. And I know you're probably thinking like, Drill, that's a lot of money. It is. But I'll be able to make that money back in no time. And then from there, it's all profit because there's so many different ways that you can monetize the app. Number one, a monthly membership. Number two, transaction fees. Number three, in-app purchases. Number four, ads. And then number five, affiliate marketing. And guess what? It's your platform. It's not like YouTube where YouTube owns it and then you're under YouTube. It's your platform. You own it, so you're getting all of that money. And if you're wondering what exactly my app is, how did I come up with the idea and all of that, all the details about my app, subscribe and turn on post notifications because I'll be revealing it in my next video for the coach. And I'm out, man.